this is just a quick little review or just video on showing you about CyanogenMod. mod this is on the galaxy player 5.0 so it's on XDA developer site I'll post a link for the developers page and it works pretty nicely there's a quite a few bugs that he's gonna fix but as of now there's no vibrations the capacitive buttons don't light up uh, you only hear the volume or music whatnot through the speakers in the back headphone jack and the earpiece don't work as of now uh, Wi-Fi has a few issues but there's a fix for it and you'll see that on his page as well um, I'll probably think of more as I go along but I'll show you some neat features that I like about Sound Mod. Let's see. Oh, seeing that storage. It doesn't recognize the SD card unless you take it out and put it back in. So right now it just shows I have 5 gigs of total space when I should have like 14 with the SD card. But So, see some of the settings. I like the lock screen settings. You can have your own gestures made. So when you unlock the screen, you make a gesture to unlock it or go to a certain page. That you can see there what I have. You can make them stuff like that. There's a lot more other things you can do. So it's not too difficult at all. It's just like an Android device, just with some extra few features. There's a whole bunch of other themes for Sign Engine Mod itself. So you can change the way it looks completely. Right now I'm using Epic Blue, which is my favorite so far. So And you can change the way the screen rotates on your home screen too. But all the features and stuff seem to work fine, other than overclocking with it's the CyanGen's built-in overclock doesn't work. But I'm using Tegrac, so and CPU tuner at the same time. Other than those few bugs and stuff, you can flash uh, Google Play, which I don't like the new name, but hey, so it works. Well, you won't flash Google Play, but you flash Google Apps, and everything else works, and you can use that. And you flash that through Clockwork Mod. So. And. To fix the Wi Fi, you just use the Wi Fi add. What's this called? This right here. So. It's an app on the app market. You can just get it. Like I said, it's on this page, so it shouldn't be too hard to find. So that's about it for this. If you want me to make more videos about to go more in depth, just ask commenters or something like that. But as of now, I'll just keep on trying to make videos with all the other ROMs I have. And so far, Cyanogen and uh, I forget which other one I used to be my favorite, so thanks for watching, and any questions, comments, just ask. Thank you.